Welcome to today's math lesson. Today, we are going to be adding two digit numbers together. And we're going to do that using dimes and pennies. Let's take a look. Today, we're going to pretend that we're shopping. And we're going to shop at a bakery or the muffin shop today. Let's go! When we go to a store, we often get a receipt. And the receipt tells us what we bought and how much it cost. At the top of our receipt, it usually tells the name of the store. Ours is going to be the muffin shop. Then on the receipt, there's places where all of the things that we buy are written down as, as well as how much they cost. So we know how much money we spent. And then at the very bottom, there's a total. And the total tells us how much money we have to give to the cashier. Are you ready to play store with me? Well, let's buy some things at the bakery. These look so yummy. I think that we should buy this yummy cupcake. How much does it cost? You're right, it's 31 cents. Well, will you count out the money for the cashier with me? Let's begin. 10, 20, 30, 31. All right, we have enough money for our cupcake. What about this yummy chocolate chip muffin? How much does that cost? You're right, it's 23 cents. Well, let's count money for that as well. When we count our dimes, we're going to count by 10. 10, 20. And when we count pennies, we're going to count by 1. 21, 22, 23. Now, if we buy both of these things, we need to add them together to get a total so we know how much money to give the cashier. So we're going to start off by adding the ones place, or the pennies. One plus three. How many pennies would that be? You're right, it would be four. And now we're going to add the tens place, or our dimes. We have three dimes plus two dimes. How many dimes all together? You're right, it would be five dimes. And we're writing that in the tens place because dimes are worth 10. Our total would be 54 cents. And we have all the money that we need to give our cashier. Oh, but what if we were at the store and we wanted to buy a chocolate chip cookie and a yummy, looks almost like a birthday cupcake. Well, let's buy a cookie. How much does the cookie cost? You're right, it's 14 cents. Will you count out money with me? 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. And now we're gonna buy a cupcake as well. How much does the cupcake cost? 32 cents. Well, let's count out our dimes and our pennies to total 32 cents. 10, 20, 30, 31, 32. Did you remember that when we're counting dimes, we count by 10? And when we count pennies, we count by one. Now, if we want to buy a cookie and a cupcake, we have to add their prices together to get our total. And when we're adding, we start with the ones place, and that's the pennies. So we have four pennies plus two more pennies. Four plus two equals six. And now we're going to add the tens place, or the dimes. We have one plus three. Well. That equals four. 46 cents is our total. Oh, I think we should play again. This time, let's buy a donut and a glazed muffin. How much does our donut cost? That's right, it's 25 cents. Count out the dimes and pennies with me. 10, 20, 
21, 22, 23, 24, and 25. And what about our muffin? That's right, it's 21 cents. Count out some coins with me. 10, 20, 21. When we add these two items together, we'll come up with our total. And we're gonna start with the ones place or the pennies. We have five pennies plus one penny. That's six pennies all together. And now if we add our dimes, we have two dimes plus two more. Two plus two is four. 46 cents is how much money we have to give to the cashier. I am so glad that you came to practice math with me today. And I hope that you have a chance to play store and pretend that you're buying some things today with coins. With some practice, I know you're gonna be able to say, I can add two digit numbers with dimes and with pennies. Thanks so much for practicing with me today. Bye-bye.